NBC5 First Warning Weather. All right, time right now, 1219. Let's check in with NBC5 First Warning Meteorologist Matt DiLoretto. Matt, I'm sure a lot of people are looking forward to the snow we're going to get tomorrow, including me. <laughs> Absolutely, me as well, and especially those ski resorts who could really use a fresh coating of that snow. I wanted to take you out to the Champlain Islands right now. Beautiful day right now out there. Shout out to Heroes Welcome General Store for letting us access this camera. Just a gorgeous shout out there looking out toward Night Island. It is cold out there right now, 14 degrees with a bit of a breeze from the north, but overall really a nice winter day out there. Temperatures ranging from the lower 20s in southern Vermont to the teens in northern New York. So certainly colder than average, but nothing we haven't seen before. Storm tracker nice and clear for us right now. A few uh, high clouds streaming in, but uh, sunshine really making its presence there, making the temperatures feel a little bit better than they are. So we'll peak around 20 degrees in Burlington today, getting into the teens tonight, and those clouds will be on the increase, so I don't think we'll see as cold of a night as we did last night. But we have alert weather for Friday, that snowstorm moving in, moving in about 2 a.m. to the south and getting up uh, about 7 a.m. to the north, that snow moving in here. It will be very fluffy snow, easy to move, wrapping up pretty quickly by 4 p.m. to the west and by 7 p.m. in eastern Vermont. We're expecting about six to nine here in the Champlain Valley and over a foot in uh, the Southern Vermont ski resort. So good news for those folks looking to ski this weekend. I wanted to take you future cast uh, showing those bright sunshine today, but those clouds are going to be on the increase as we head toward 10 or 11 o'clock. And by 2 a.m., I think we should start to see the snow really get into Southern Vermont. Moving up toward Northern Vermont by 7 a.m., all of us should at least be seeing light snow, maybe some heavier snow down in Southern Vermont. And by lunchtime, all of us getting into those heavier rates. So certainly a fluffy and heavy snow for a period of time there. But the thing about this, it is a very quick mover. It's out of here mostly by 4.30 p.m. with some clearing by uh, midnight on Saturday. So quick mover, quick hitter and travel impacts will be high only for a short period of time, especially late a.m. and early p.m. as those heavier snow rates. Good for those cleanup efforts uh, as the snow moves out of here Friday. And how much snow are we expecting? About six to nine here in northern Vermont. A little bit less as you head toward the uh, Route 11 corridor, but more in southern Vermont, especially in those higher elevations. I want to take you a look at how the snow really adds up here. In Burlington, we're expecting about seven or eight inches total. Heaviest rates between 11 and 3 p.m. here with an increase of about three inches in four hours. So that's about an inch or so an hour falling. In Malone, we're expecting a little bit less, maybe five or six inches total with again those heavier rates between 11 a.m. and 3 p.m. And let's talk about the most important part of the forecast, how much snow the summits are going to get. We're looking at about 6 to 12 for Smugs Notch, one of my favorite uh, spots to ski there. Bolton Valley 6 to 12 as well, a little bit more as you head toward those southern resorts, maybe as much as a foot and a half possible at Okemo and Stratton. And uh, more of the same here uh, around Stowe and Sugarbush, 6 to 12. I think JP could see more than 3 to 6 for sure. Killington and Mount Snow cashing in around 12 to 18 as well. So really good news for those skiers that want to get out this weekend. Saturday is going to be the pick of the weekend to do that. Sunshine, bright skies, temperatures in the upper 20s. Getting into the 30s with some snow showers Sunday, colder Monday. And as March begins, warming back up into the 30s. Back to you, Zuri. Matt, thanks so much. And so obviously this is your first day on air. We're so excited to have you. We know you're a skier, but tell us uh, some other things about yourself. Well, I'm really excited to be here, Zuri. And um, I have really loved weather since I was just a little kid. So I've always known I wanted to do this as my job. And you know, it's really great that these dreams are coming true just right now. Um, and I do love to ski. So I'm looking forward to maybe getting some uh, time up on the slopes at some point. And yes. um, I'm excited to be in Burlington. Awesome. We are so glad to have you. And of course, you're going to be sticking around and chatting with Tyler uh, later this evening. So we'll see you again at 5 o'clock. Absolutely. You'll see a lot more of me. Thanks a lot, yes. Surrey.